You are not going to believe this, but I promise you it's true. And good thing I got it on camera. I found two jellyfish stranded on the beach. You did them back in the water far enough to where they wouldn't get washed back up. But right afterwards, I found this shrimp infected with an invasive, blood-sucking isopod parasite. This shrimp's name was Sandra. I carefully lifted up her gill flap and removed the chunky parasite that's been infesting her gills. This big one is the female. This little white one trying to stay behind is the male. I got them both out and turned Sandra over to check the other side. And sure enough, there was another female parasite attached to her other gills. I've only seen this once before. Now this is the crazy part. There was another huge male on that female parasite. That's a record number of parasites that I've seen on one shrimp. Afterwards, I yeeted the parasites to Franklin the sea chicken and he gobbled them up. I'm trying to raise awareness for these shrimp and help remove this invasive species issue. So if you'd like to help me on my mission, I hope you consider liking this video and be sure to follow if you love ocean animals. I was enjoying some fresh rocks and seaweeds when all of a sudden I saw a shrimp lying on the ground trying to die. I quickly spit out my lunch and ran over to help. Turns out, it was my good friend Samantha. Her gills were infested with a blood-sucking isopod parasite, and it was preventing Samantha from becoming a single mother. Not today, parasite. I yeeted it to my good friend Steven Seagal, gave Samantha some pets, and set her free. Be sure to follow if you love ocean animals. I was looking for shrimps with parasites, but there were so many shrimp holes to choose from. I got my slurper ready and just went for it. Pretty soon I found what I was looking for, an infected shrimp named Bella. I helped her by removing the invasive isopod parasites so that she would be able to carry eggs and make shrimpy babies. She had a male and female parasite. I gave Bella some pets to make her feel better, fed the parasite to a hungry sea chicken named Franklin, set Bella free, and be sure to follow if you love ocean animals. Have a good day, Matilda. Holy shrimp! Today, we're going to be removing invasive, blood-sucking isopod parasites from our little shrimp friends. Our first appointment is with Jessica. Hey, Jessica. And don't worry, we're going to get this bulging blood sucker removed from your gills in no time. It's okay, calm down. There we go. Good shrimpy. And there's actually two parasites here. This big chunky female and the little white male. All right, before we help the next shrimp, let's feed these parasites to Franklin the sea chicken. Have a good day, Jessica. 